coverage you can count on continues with Storm Team 10 meteorologist Everett Lau. Good morning and happy Saturday as we look at the Storm Team 10 storm tracker this morning. Most of us are dry after getting some of that rain yesterday, but there are still a few lingering showers, especially in the southern tier of the News 10 Voon area. So we can zoom in and take a closer look. This is Clay County, Illinois. You can see some steady rain just to the south of Flora and between Flora and Clay City and just to the south of that, seeing some more moderate rainfall there. Also around Louisville and just to the west, seeing a pocket of more moderate rainfall. As we go farther to the east, you can see some more of those showers just to the west of Vincennes along the Knox and Lawrence County, Illinois line. You can South of Lawrenceville. And then you can see another shower just to the north of Petersburg down here along the White River and some lingering showers still this morning in southern parts of Martin County. So zoom out and look at a little more of a regional view. You can see we still have a lot of cloud cover out there this morning. This front slowly going to continue to sink down to the south, and as it does so, the rain showers will move out, and eventually the cloud cover will clear out as well. So we have some clearing taking place over central Illinois, and eventually that will settle in, giving us some sunshine as we get into the afternoon. So I'm tracking that gradual clearing. It's also going to be a breezy day. But now that the fronts pass through, we're going to have some pleasant temperatures this weekend here in the Wabash Valley, and the humidity will gradually decrease as well. Today's still going to be a relatively humid day, not going to be oppressive, but by the time we get to tomorrow, feeling a lot more comfortable with our dew points continuing to drop. So look at our wind speed already this morning. We still have a breeze out of the northeast at 13 miles per hour in Robinson and Terre Haute, 14 down in Vincennes, 12 in Brazil, and a 9 mile per hour breeze right now in Paris and in Mattoon. And it's going to continue with us throughout the course of the day and even into the night, gusting at times as high as 20 miles per hour. So look at our temperatures. Most spots are in the 70s, though there are a few 60s out there at 68 in Rockville, 69 for Paris and Brazil, 71 currently here in Terre Haute along with Newton and Effingham, 74 for Flora and Olney, and it's currently 73 down in Vincennes. So as we go over the next five days, temperatures going to stay pretty close to where they should. Average high for this time of year is 87 degrees. Today going to be a little bit cooler, though. We'll be down around the lower 80s. Then for tomorrow, back up to 85. Monday climbing up close to 90 degrees, but then we'll see another weak front slide in here as we get into Monday night and Tuesday. And that'll keep our temperatures right around the upper 80s by the time we get to the end of the week. So here's a look at Futurecast over the course of your day. If you have anything you need to do outside, this afternoon, definitely going to be a drier bet with some more sunshine. You can see some of those scattered showers out there this morning. Those will be gradually clearing out. Still by lunchtime, I think the southern half of the area especially is still going to be dealing with some cloud cover. But you notice by the time we get to 3 o'clock, a lot of that starts to break down. That will be allowing for more sunshine by the time we finish up the day. Here's 6 o'clock this evening. You can see a mostly sunny sky taking place. We're still going to have that breeze coming out of the northeast, and that's going to take us into the overnight hours. Expecting a mostly clear sky, that's going to set us up for a cool night with lows dropping into the upper 50s. So you give the air conditioning a break and let in some fresh air. As we go into tomorrow, starting off the day with lots of sunshine, and that's going to be the trend over the course of our Sunday. A very quiet day. Temperatures once again climbing up into the middle 80s, so it's going to be a pretty comfortable day for any of the activities going on for your weekend. And as we get into Monday night or Sunday night, staying clear, and Monday, more sunshine once again. For today, forecast going to be 83 for the high. Again, the clouds of this morning and some lingering showers to the south, but then becoming sunny. Wind gusts could be as high as 20 miles per hour. Then for tonight, we'll drop down to 57 degrees under a mostly clear sky, holding on to that breeze out of the north, maybe north northeast. And then for tomorrow, sunny and seasonable, 85 and not as humid. And the seven day forecast shows another dry stretch of weather, so thankfully we got that rain when we did. Maybe just a slight chance of showers Monday night.